Hey y'all, welcome back. Today I'm gonna be retwisting these starter locks and this is more of a watch me work video. At the beginning I'm gonna give you a little explanation and then I'm gonna let y'all be. But he has been coming every six to eight weeks to get those locks retwisted. Um, at the beginning of the video I had just shampooed and conditioned his hair. I condition every single lock client because I feel like the hair still needs to be healthy. And if you don't condition it, that's when you see down the road those people whose locks start to break off. That's because that hair at the beginning was not properly cared for. It's still here, y'all. Even if you're locking it, it's still here. Proper hair care is important. So when I do him his locks, he is the most pickiest client. He is very particular how he wants everything done, y'all. But he always asks that as I'm retwisting them, I stretch them as far as possible because he don't care what direction I got to pull them in to make sure they're stretched. He wants them as stretched as possible. And then after they're fully dry, he can kind of shake them around and move them how he wants. But, you know, these little teenagers, y'all, y'all, if he wasn't family, no, I'm just playing. But anyways, I am using some gel. I prefer a water-based gel when retwisting locks. I know that some people like those gels that have more of the edge control consistency, but they're not my preference. I mean, you do what works for you, but me personally, I feel like you end up with a lot of buildup later on down the line versus when you use a water-based gel, the tendency of flaking usually is a little higher, but the tendency of buildup is less because you can just literally rinse that mess away. And this particular client of mine is a basketball player, so he sweats all the time. So I just feel like he needs something that will just not be gunky because to me when you have those edge control base those thicker ones they tend to get a little gunky when that sweat comes in so I don't know it's just personal preference but I use a water-based gel so I'm just making sure that his parts are neat and I'm just palm rolling that's it I keep it simple I did start his with coils if you're interested in seeing how I started his I will link the video from the first time I did his hair in the description box I probably drop it in the comment section because y'all don't be reading the description box. I literally will post all the products and somebody will be like, where do I get them? Ma'am, the link is literally in the description box. But you know, you know, y'all know. But anyways, I'm going to shut up and let y'all watch me work. And oh, one more thing. I've been getting a lot of questions of them unraveling. Make sure that before you take the clips out, your client's hair is 100% dry. That will eliminate a lot of that. If you make sure their hair is dry, you 99.99% will never see unraveling again. You'll just see new growth. So make sure that your client's hair is 100% dry before you unclip it. All right, I'm done. I'll see y'all on my next video don't forget to subscribe and turn on your post notifications and help your girl out and thumbs up every video of mine you see all right see y'all bye